Well, greetings and salutations, everyone. Welcome back once again for the very first time to the Farts and Crap Show, where today, as per usual, it's your host, Anjo, here with part 44 of Xenogears, the PS1 version here on Retro Classics. Hope you guys are all doing well today. And on today's episode, we are continuing from last time, obviously, uh, leaving Nortoon. And, uh, I think I went with Departing Nortoon previously. And, um, yeah. Surprisingly, we kind of just left. The guards decided not to pick a fight with us because they didn't have a death wish. Although Rico popped in and one-shotted all of them anyway. And then said he wouldn't leave the city with us, although we can change our party at the Wildcat, put Rico in the party, and then leave Nortoon with him, and he doesn't say anything about it, and his collar does not explode. And, um, inexplicably, we all have access to our gears for whatever reason. Kind of strange. To be real. Like, we can just go into the gear menu and get on, get on, get on. Which is kind of strange. What is the magnetic coat? Reese's response, okay. Defense, right. Uh, extra arm, three. I'm just gonna equip everybody with some stuff. Uh, that's fine. Old circuit. Wait a minute. Is two old circuits? Wait, did they automatically... I don't think he had these before. Damn, by 15? Beam damage down 75%. Yeah, I think that's what, um... Uh, whatever Rico's gear is called, pretty sure he had that equipped by default, because, like, he was taking a third of the damage that, uh, crap, Veltal was taking from, like, the beams in that last boss fight with, like, What's her name? Can't remember the names for shit today, apparently. <laughs> Sorry. Um, agility and desert? Okay. Camera damage. These apparently do the same thing. Strength. I mean, I'm assuming that's like one of her things too, so. Probably. She's more of an ether fighter in general, that's probably better for her. Oh, the Hot Rod G is for her! Ah. Okay. Well, now I'm glad I got that. Also, she only has 1500 HP. Can we hit up um, the gear shop for these guys? Is that something we can do? I mean, Nortoon didn't really have one. I mean, they did, but it was that one guy in the... I don't think we can go back there. Can we go... The desert town. Right? They had a gear shop. 
They said they couldn't work on Beltal, though. Yeah, what if we try going back to... Yeah, whatever happened to Bart? Like, they never... They never clarified what happened there. I mean... We could just head to the destination, I think. We're, we're heading north, okay? To the... What'd they call it? The supply... Some... Thing. Anyway, um... Can we go any faster? No? Can we jump? No? Okay. I, I'm assuming there's gonna be a way... We seriously can't cross little rivers. Like, this is just a barrier. They said it was north of Nortoon. And I think it's a little faster. It's poor birds. Um. Damn. Terra Storm Learn. Okay, cool. I think it's a little bit faster to traversal on the map in the gears. Oh, really? Trees are just a barrier? Okay. So, how do we get up there? Can we go... We can't go around, right? Left border, here's where the danger begins. Yeah, but we can't go straight north. Can we get rid of that text box, please? I can't see the map. Oh, it's just saying we can't go this way? Are you fucking serious? Wait. So was there another way to get out of here? She's learning something every single fight. Like, gears can jump. It's such a small fucking barrier. So... There wasn't a scene or anything that played when we left Nortoon. And I'm not seeing a way we seem to be trapped. Please no. Like, I 
think we have to go back into Nortun. Is there like an underground... Oh wait, do we have to go through the sewers? Like we were able to leave A block just fine. And we tried going in here at the end of the last episode, and they are like, no. I mean, they have a gear paddock in Battling Arena. Are we supposed to go here? Oh, this place is different. Beyond here is the competitor's gear storage paddock. Prevent cheating. Unauthorized entry is prohibited. Please keep back. I mean, nobody else is here, so... Like that. It's the only other thing. So it has to be something in D block, right? Like there is this supply train thing, but that seemed like a one time thing. some stuff written on them. There's lots more than that. Yeah, I know. Fucking posters. I know what posters are. Hey, what was this place? Oh, this was the other thing. The info center. What do you want to know? Uh, nothing. We're good. Scales, eyeballs, fangs, and hob jerky. Welcome to be info center. Oh, right, they're putting an unnecessary period after info still. Right. So it's not supposed to be period, and then they're not. The info center is like the name of the place, which is why it's capitalized, because it's a proper noun. Right. Uh, by the looks of it, you've seen your fair share of battles. I expect you'll earn a pretty penny. Rare items? Choose items to exchange. Items question mark? Gee, what? Choose items to exchange. Oh, that's just to switch menus. Okay, I don't think we have ivory, right? Okay. Okay. I know we have scales. Yeah, I gotcha. And I don't want to get rid of our hob meat or hob jerky because that's actually like restorative shit. We have fangs. We have one eyeball, or two. Leon Bell Amulet? Renately certain carved surface? Okay. Like, 
Okay, at the end of the sewers, though, there is that door. And it just went up. It didn't go anywhere. Okay. These earnings are 40 half jerky, 10 scales, 13 fangs and eyeballs, totally ruined. Okay, I don't care. That's when I thought I could finally earn a living. Along comes a humongously strong monster in the sewers. Yo! Seems that a champ beat the monster, that doesn't mean there's only one. I don't like the idea, but I need the money. Battling, that's what Nortune is famous for. Need parts to customize your gear? Just in time for the movement to strengthen our military power in opposition to Avaz's assaults on our Imperial capital. We have new line of gear parts, don't miss out. Oh, they do? Oh, they have a gear shop here. Okay, great. Tune up. Uh, no. Engine? Well, that's all the same. That's what I have right now. That's what I have right now. Five parts. Circuit. By how much, though? Alright, I'll buy a response circuit, I guess. Right, gee, we already got that. Okay, tune up. F no, not fuel. Engine. Choose a V15. What the fuck? Okay, frame. Gear. 4,000? Yes, please. It's a huge difference. He's an MS-15 already, okay. So fuel, yeah. It's weird they put the fuel in the butt. Just, just saying. Let's get a Z9. How much fuel does he have? 1500. E12. 2000. So that is better. Frame. It's got 2500 HP. So much better. Yeah. Got an MS9. So yeah, get an MS15, dude. This is becoming very expensive. Um, did I fuel? Okay. That is way fucking better. And, whoops. Sorry. Would you? What were you saying? For all you sacks of shit. Fuck. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sorry. Even under fire, as hard as on gears, 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 nothing but gears. Uh, maybe I should look for another man. I've had it with battlers. I made some money, but now they have new parts. I want them, but I don't have enough G. Circuit response and defense. The defense isn't going down when I hit on circuit, it's just response is up by 10. Which, I mean, that's great. I don't know what response does. That's cool.
I'll just leave it the way it is, I guess. Okay. I mean, that's cool. Essentially a gear shop, you know, that's helpful. It is one of the things I was looking for. But what the fuck are we supposed to do? Place a Nissan facility. Here are you. Um... Should I go back outside? No, it goes upstairs. Oh yeah, and there was nothing in here, and I was like, that's really fucking weird. Why have, like, this room? There's, like, nothing here. Oh, there's somebody up here now. Even in a smoggy town, if you take special care of water and plants, flowers will bloom. That's fascinating, but... What the fuck am I supposed to do? There's dorms full of battlers, and like bars, dorms full of people coming and going. Okay. I thought maybe that spot in the alleyway, like where Rico and Faye first fought? The sun is gone. Tomorrow comes, my daughter will leave our home. Aside from my son, my daughter is only five. She won't be leaving for a long time. Always so worried. You just said she's leaving tomorrow. What the fuck? They only let me out when we go to church on the weekends. I'm bored being cooped up in the house. I could go and play with the church folk. go. Who are you? Don't get in the way of my job. I keep this room orderly. Fine. Was there anybody else to talk to down here? It was just the doctor. She didn't have really anything to say. Guys, I might actually have to use a walkthrough for the first time. I'm a battler in training with prisoner rank C. Get a giddy. Today's menu is whoa, Ether Omega. Yeah, this is the same joke from before. It's like, oh, my friend is gonna skyrocket. No, that won't happen. Nortune, the capital of Kislev Empire, is made up of five blocks. E block is just five? E block is just one of them. It serves as a giant prison. I'm a wandering battler. Battling games are over, so I'm thinking of leaving in search of new battlefields. Oh, and don't you dare ask me how it went. Male or female doesn't matter on the battlefield. Yeah, we already talked about this. Who would have thought that someone would beat Ricardo? Battling's undefeated champ. I mean, I don't. And the new champ, I just don't believe it. Sorry, I forget I ever said that. Alright, fucking. I'm gonna go to the sewer and see if there's like anything anybody up there yeah and what about the people who are like ah champ champ like where'd they go I don't have much strength but I know I mean granted they have like generic sprites but I know I won't lose to anyone in the manual dexterity department 
so I'm doing the perfect job for me, fixing the roof. Pays almost as well as working the sewers. Okay. Amazing. Taking on the sewer monster, the battling champ. Compared to that, I'm just... Always be just guard captain. How'd you get like that? Quit your regular job and start battling? Guess you have to do it, but it's impossible for me. I'm not that type. Hey, do you have any spare dog food, man? I know a dog that, like... will bark a lot and I can't stand it. Wanna buy some dog food? Yes, I do. Give it to him and he'll be quiet. I'll take it. Okay, it'll be 5G. Haha, <laughs> here you go. Nope, oh, now we have dog food, man. It's a dog that's... Miserable. Not that dog. He's just barking his ass off. The guy's do got dog food. He can feed him. Crap, the champ losing was unbelievable. It's like 20 to 5. Almost everyone bet on the champ. Me? About half a year's salary. All of it, every, all of it, everything's stupid. Guess I'll be working in the sewers too. Is there anybody over here? Like this guy? Can we, can we talk? A ton of monsters down there. So don't go in unless you're good. The stupid battlers and battle hunters are always coming and going. That's what you said before, dude. Oh, there's a guy over there. Should I talk to that guy? He's not moving. Fuck. I thought the can I thought the angle would be better, man. Where the platforming is like kind of shit sometimes. If the game had analog control, like I'd give it a bit more slack. And I don't think it does, because I already tested that. Shut up, I can see that. Snuck in from the duct. Not. Nah, I was repairing the duct. Maybe it'd be better if you just settle down and get to work. Not sewer cleaning, but... Fuck. Damn it. Shut up, dude. Snuck in from the duck. Not with, like... Is he being sarcastic? Like, what's... What the hell am I supposed to do? I mean, was there more people to talk to? I guess like in the bar, maybe? I mean, there are more people in here. Tina's looking good as always. She's there blocks Venus, don't you think so? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Certified, okay, whatever. Uh-huh. Tina, Latina, give me another drink. Oh, if it isn't you. Hey, aren't you the battling champ? Uh, is there something I can do for you? Please forgive my, uh, me for any disrespect in the past. Oh yeah, by the way, you can exchange monster items for prizes in the B info. Yeah, I know. You're sitting here, you're pretty much sentenced for life. Probably never be able to set foot in my home. Yeah, we already talked about that, dude. Now you shouldn't drown your sorrows in liquor. I know, but I can't stop. Also, where the fuck is Hammer? Hammer's gone. Add him around, you know. It's kind of lonely in this bar. Around here, the criminals are higher up than the residents. Powerless have no other choice but to kneel. Alright. Used to be in charge of security in the civilian area. Because of minor mistake, they shipped me off to look after... Yeah, we already talked about this. Who are you again? Battling champ? No interest in such things. By the way, stuff good. 
Is what stuff good? What? And Latina, what was your thing? New Year Power is genuine. Even to... Okay, yeah, very, yeah, very talked about that. I mean, I guess we didn't talk to everybody in here. Uh, did you see my brother outside? I'm always the one left behind. They won't let me play, so it's too dangerous for me to go outside. Alright, fine. Whatever. Fifteen years ago in the Empire, there was a great riot. There were many casualties. Alright. During the riot in the Empire, homes and families were... Yeah, you already mentioned all this. We already talked about all this. Like, they said we need to leave and go north. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna try just ducking into the sewers real quick, see if there's like... That seems like maybe the obvious answer, like, go through the sewers. There's no cutscene or anything. No conversation. And I don't want to go through the entire fucking sewers just to, like, be met with a dead end, honestly. Like, that sounds shitty. And it's a pretty long process to get through the whole place, so... I don't see a reason to. But maybe the you can pass. Are you sure? <laughs> Do I go back in here and like the dog isn't here? Oh wait, before, when Rico broke in, he didn't go past these guys here. He like jumped impossibly high to the... I think something, I don't know what the fuck. I mean, there's not another place to go, right? No. So it's gotta be, what, somewhere in A block? I mean, Big Joe was out here. Did the Ava attack the entire prelink is along presently the front gate is the only one for my civilians, please go that one. Fine. Like where the fuck are we supposed to go? was constantly talking and like I guess it was the other shop the item shop maybe there's something else in a block that you're supposed to do and I just missed it busy 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 is that it just talk about how busy he is same as last time I mean, I'm hoping when I go to the right place, it'll be obvious. Uh. I don't think there's anything else in this area. It's the two shops and the bar. And I talked to everybody in the bar. Another hand before I die, I want to see the face of my grand. Yeah, really grand grandma, it's almost hard. Don't say it before I die, right? It's like 
I'm not really sure what it means or what it's good for. Absolutely nothing. Danjo already made that joke. Alright. Get the, let's get the fuck out of here. I don't understand... Okay, there's the wildcat. Barry went back there into the alleyway. City's other name is the town of Steam because Steam is being blown out everywhere that I can see. When we go out of your house, you can get a bitch black all over and blah 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 and we're his skin. Uh huh. This is how we jumped into the toilet in the other room. Which, like, maybe. said I need to take a shit. <laughs> no? They're all just like my daughter. What the f- You have new dialogue, random person that's in the doctor's house? And apparently this is like a cutscene conversation because the camera did like a thing and I can't fucking shift it right now. She was the one who told me to go talk to the doctor in D-Block. Like, she kept up her promise you should go talk to her. And now she has another thing? Alright. This is the most obscure fucking shit. You're all just like my daughter. She won't give up. So many people. Must be hard for you to get around. You wanna change here? Oh, I can also change my party in here. No, that's fine. Okay, by the way, did you go meet my daughter working in D-Block? Please go see her. I did. What's your fucking deal, dude? What's with me? You're just standing in front of the fucking house, bro. It's creepy. Why are you being such a creeper? And he goes and stands over there. Back at Army King of Vaughn, Imperial Capital is really scary. The heavens again, I'm out of here. Perhaps I might move to Nisa. Okay, cool, cool. And then these are the shops and shit again. This guy? Item shop, right. Maybe this guy? Flying battleship crash on the northwestern area of D-Block. Uh, no, I just came from D-Block. It's the exact same as it was. Maybe there's a reason for this, like, car being here? Aside from just looking cool in the middle of town? Using a vase raid in Imperial Capital as a pretext to start up another massive war effort. Oh, this door! be an ender all this fighting. I don't know, dude. Head cook told us off. I'd like to let you enter for a while the barracks are off limits. Well, I'm sorry, dude. It's the only other town. It's, it's the only other door in town. It's the only place I haven't checked. It's not an exit. Okay, I didn't talk to the kids again, but children should play outside for their own health. That's common thinking, right? In this town covered in dirty steam, it's probably not that good for us. You know, my big sister has a friend called a fiance. He didn't have any... Yeah, okay, fine. We already talked about all this shit. So it's not an A block. Is this actually a different exit over here? It just says world map. But it is the north exit. Nope.
Like, there doesn't seem to be anywhere we can go. Except, like, maybe through the sewer? Possibly? I guess it's back to D-Block. Right. Maybe talking to the doctor again? Be something different? What time are we at? Look, we're at 40 minutes already? Shit. Like, this isn't it. I have no idea. Plenty of work to do it brings the most happiness. I keep doing my best, so you keep up the fight. It's promised in Nortoon. Nope, that's the only thing she says. Alright, guys. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna break my cardinal rule of a blind playthrough. called Secret Weapon. Yeah, it's obviously a secret. I'm gonna check a walkthrough. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm not... I'm going to try to only... Actually, you know, I'm not gonna check a walkthrough. I'm going to... do a web search for the question. Maybe for the name of the chapter. Try to keep it spoiler free. And just try to figure out where to go. Because like, technically we can leave Nortoon, even with Rico in the party if we wanted to. Seems really wrong. And when they were talking about escaping the city, they were like, well, we could go through the battling arena or the supply train. And it was like, sure. And that whole thing was convoluted. Yes, the sewers don't lead outside the city, which is really weird. And I, yeah, we could try the sewers again, but like, the encounter rate down there is like nuts. And like, just going, taking a walk through the sewers would take like a long time. And the exit is kind of not really an exit. where all the drains met and everything. There was like a way to jump up, but it was like basically a dead end functionally. And yeah, even if I leave the town, there's no way to go. As far as I could see, like can't cross the river and go in the ocean. We can't go to the Kislev border. So, what the fuck? I have no idea. No fucking clue. So, um, yeah. I don't have... I feel like I don't have any other choice. I have to look it up. So, anyway. Maybe there's something missing? Maybe there's something I'm missing. Again, I feel like... In a game where you present most of the information as text, I feel like the localization is very important. <laughs> Maybe there was something in the text that was like, hey, this is what we're going to be doing, or this is what we're, you know. Maybe the hint was more obvious in the original Japanese. I have no idea. Going off of the information they've provided? No fucking clue. 
no fucking clue. That's the only other idea I have is like maybe through the sewers, but the sewers don't even like connect anywhere else. Or maybe like on the track that like the train was running on, maybe just like actually run on the track. I don't know. It seems like a possibility. I don't think that's even possible. It's based on how the hitboxes were when I was trying to jump on the train. Seems like that was only possible because it was a scripted thing. It, it seems like there's another way we're supposed to leave Kislev. Not Kislev. Uh, Nortun. To the north. Because, yeah, going just. It doesn't seem like the right way to go. And it feels off. So. Yeah, I'm gonna have to look it up. Or maybe there was something to interact with on the world map that I just... I missed? Possibly? I don't know. I don't know. We're just trying to think of, like, anything at all that would possibly make sense. So, I don't know. But... Uh, if you guys have played this game before, like, let me know in the comments by the time I get to those comments. Like, I will have already figured it out, because I'm going to figure it out right now, and in the next episode, we'll be able to make progress. Because, yeah, I know there's got to be, like, a million freaking, you know, Q&As, uh, walkthroughs, uh, FAQs, that's what I meant, um, for this game, like, that came out, what, almost 30 years ago? So, yeah. I mean, 25 years ago, but, um, yeah. What is it actually, 27? Almost, yeah, 26 years ago, comfortably. Yeah. Anyway, it's gonna do it for today. Thank you all for being here, guys. Uh, let me know how much of an idiot I am in the comments. <laughs> I'd, I'd love to hear about it. Regardless, hope you guys found this uh, video entertaining or whatever. It's yeah, I usually it's pretty different from my usual videos where I make progress on something. Uh, the only progress I feel like I made on this one is I found out you can change your party in the doctor's house, and we talked to a bunch of NPCs, some of which had new dialogue, and we bought some dog food, so that's cool. But yeah, I'm gonna do it for today. Uh, before we get going, a very special thank you going out to the current Farts and Crap Show members. Uh, the amazing people who make it possible. The Bellish Draconis, Aaron Chick, WTF, Corey, and Rogue XOX. Thank you so much for choosing to support the show a bit more directly via channel membership. It vastly helps out. We very much appreciate it. And uh, in case you guys want to be incredibly awesome and uh, get in on all those membership benefits, check out that join button down below or the link in the description in case there's no join button for you. Um, before we get into the membership details, I should mention, uh, the reason why WTF Corey and Rogue XOX have an at in front of their screen name is because those are handles and they have channels of their own. So definitely go check it out, which you can easily do by going to youtube.com slash at and then the rest of the handle and it'll take you straight there because handles make URLs quite a bit easier. They make navigation quite a bit easier on YouTube and, um, they are unique. So it's another way to double check, make sure you're in the right place. No two handles are the same. Um, but yeah, membership tiers start at $3 a month. 10 cents a day gets you into all the basic stuff, including getting to vote on the series get made here on the channel via the members' choice polls. It's a thing we do once a month for a full seven days over on the membership tab, which you'll have access to if you have a channel membership. And um, it's how all the series get decided here on the channel. And, um, yeah, there's a lot of previous ones up there as well, so if you haven't already, you can vote on them. And, uh, retroactive input is considered for future polls, which we will have one coming up pretty soon for October. We haven't done the October one yet. Uh, it's more than likely going to be the last week of the month, but I'm not really sure at this point in time. 
because this is an approximation of future announcements from the past by the time you guys are watching this. So if you want all the announcements as they happen and the bell doesn't work for you, I totally got you. Totally. I totally get that. Got you. Yeah. I got you. Yeah. The bell doesn't work for me either. There's three other ways you guys can stay up to date. The community tab here on the channel, the Farts and Crap Show Twitter, maybe, or the Discord. Um, say maybe on the Twitter slash X thing because eh, there's a lot of crap going on over there, like just on Twitter slash X in general, and uh, a lot of people stopped using it, so we might be moving the Farts and Crap Show Twitter over to Blue Sky keep things familiar and all that other stuff and I've heard it's pretty good alternative and I've been looking into it a little bit yeah we might be we might be doing that so um, in the future I will be updating the link for that if possible um, but for the time being yeah so uh, but yeah, links for those are down in the description, also on the channel banner. But the main point is, yeah, those three, like, I always post on those whenever there's an announcement. So, whichever of them works for you, you can stay up to date. Um, that's gonna do it for now. I'm gonna go check some online resources to see what we need to do, and hopefully not spoil anything for myself. And uh, yeah, till next time, take care and I hope you all have a beautiful day.